Well, actually, uh, you know, I, I left WWE in 2005, and uh, ever since then, I was in uh, Mexico. I worked in Mexico for like three or four years, Lucha Libre. Um, it went well. I mean, I, I have a new career. My, my name there is Marco Corleone. Um, it's a sexy name. Corleone. Yeah, it's, it's, it's cool, right? <laughs> sexy name, Marco Corleone. And actually, right now, um, I might as well, you guys are actually the first to know, um, starting June 19th on MTV2 will be a Lucha Libre program um, made up of 80% Mexican luchadors and about 20% Americans. Um, a lot of masks, you see a lot of masks and stuff, and uh, it's just June 19th, MTV2 at one o'clock, and uh, that's what I'm doing right now. I'm the head of talent for that, that um, for this new project, and I'm the one who contracts everybody. I'm actually here in New York doing a lot of co uh, contracting some of the Americans that are gonna be involved with this project, and uh, that's about it, that's about it. Very cool, what was your experience like in the WWE? It was good, it was good, it taught me, it taught me do the things that I'm doing now, you know, like it taught me, Vince McMahon is a marketing genius, Vince McMahon is a, he's, he's a smart man, you know, obviously he's got his, his act together and um, there's a lot of goals, a lot of things that I, I, I learned there, you know, the things I wanted to do, but you know, I didn't have the best success there, but like, you know, when I moved to Mexico, like, for example, like I just wrote a book, a children's book in Mexico, in Spanish, I speak, yo hablo espanol también. Uh, and uh, it, it's changed me. It's changed my life. You know, I, I, I left WWE in 2005, and um, I was only a wrestler my whole life, you know. So I almost was about to hang up my boots. And, uh, and in 2006, I got the uh, chance to go perform in Mexico City, Mexico. And immediately, um, I hit, you know. Immediately, in fact, now I do more TV there, soap operas and and game shows. In fact, last week I did Family Feud in Mexico in Spanish, you know. So... It's like watching the watching show as a kid, and now, now I'm doing it in Mexico, you know? So no one really knows either because, you know, my name there is Mark, Mark, uh, Marco Corleone. Here I was Mark Jindrak, and to me, Mark Jindrak's dead. Sorry, Mark, rest in peace, Mark Jindrak. <laughs> uh, but no, but I, I, I'm happy now, you know? I, I mean, I'm the head of talent for this new project. Um, I just, like I said, just wrote this book. Um, I'm doing so many soap operas and TVs and music videos and stuff like that. It's, 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 I'm like the John Cena of Mexico, so... <laughs> Um, you know, but thank God, thank God for the other opportunity in my career. Because sometimes you never get a chance, a second chance in your career to make a first impression. So, but uh, my experience in WWE was good. You know, thank God. You know that I, that I I took that as a learning experience. It wasn't. I didn't have the success that I wanted. I think I was I wasn't mature enough to receive or open myself for all the uh, possibilities. But now in Mexico, I, I did. A, I'm doing everything that I wanted to do in WWE. So. Aside from the upcoming project on MTV2, where can your friends find you? Um, well, my, my website is marcocorleone.com. Um, and also, uh, you know, I'm just any kind of Mexican television. Turn on, turn on any Mexican channel and you'll see my name and my face. <laughs> All right. Thank you so much. Thank you.